I would have to say I was inspired to start the mobile bartending business from working at multiple bars and realizing that the love and time and care that is put into a business is, I feel like a bar business is better when I'm the boss. So just some background about the company. Um, we are a wellness hub that is creating community through online and in-person content and experiences. Um, we are centering this brand around people of color just because in the space of wellness, I have my own wellness struggles that I was going through and I just found it frustrating that there weren't enough spaces within the wellness industry that were curated again for people of color specifically. Um, there was that, again, I had some health issues that I was experiencing and through that, I was able to heal myself and that just really inspired me to create this company to let other people know to embrace the fact that you absolutely can heal your health um, through you know diet exercise and different lifestyle changes well i'm a very fortunate person and i've kind of been surrounded by plants my whole life my parents work in the plant wellness industry and my grandfather's a farmer and i've always grown up enjoying gardening and it's been a really important outlet for me but especially in philadelphia a we don't really see plant stores or too many things plant related in our neighborhoods nor do we see people who look like us in these spaces so we wanted to start this business to show that plants should be a part of everyone's lives and doing it in an accessible manner I chose to participate in the Be Smart program primarily because I had been already introduced to a lot of entrepreneurial communities outside of the greater Philadelphia area. And I felt like because my business is based in Philly and it services individuals in Philly, the greater PA and New Jersey area, I needed to have some type of anchoring here as well. Um, in addition to all of the other connections that I was building. So Be Smart was a nice way to introduce myself to other entrepreneurs and business owners here and build that connection and build that community for the growth of my business. Honestly, the pandemic inspired me to start my business. I was fresh out of school uh, looking for work and I was approached with an opportunity to be a graphic recorder. At the time, I'd never heard of it. And the way that it was explained to me was that I got to draw people's conversations, um, generally like how I take notes anyway, and it was an actual job. People would pay me to draw their conversations, to take notes for them uh, for situations that they may or may not understand or want to get a bigger picture on. Some of the most beneficial knowledge I've gained from the program have been the financial skills, how to read financial documents, as well as compile different things when we are applying for more capital. The program most definitely encouraged me to get out there more with networking, especially with other fellow entrepreneurs because I am a very customer-based person, so I have no problem presenting my business to customers, but building those connections within other people and creating um, entrepreneurial networks within the West Philly community. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, again, the director of the program, Precious, um, truly is just that precious. I absolutely love her. I told her, I was like, I don't know about you, but you're my mentor. Like, sorry, I don't really know what you, you're never leaving my life. Um, so her, I would say, I think I can, again, look for her for help when it comes to like strategic partnerships. Um, and then again, just overall business mentorship. Um, the people in the program also are amazing. I'm really excited to keep supporting them and championing, championing them um, while they are continuing their business endeavors. And then even just the other, the professionals and the businesses that came to speak with us, those are also people that I have tapped in with and will continue to develop relationships with. Money. <laughs> Definitely financials. I feel like um, a lot of people in my community, I know a lot of people in my family don't necessarily have the best relationship with money. Uh, we've all heard that credit is a thing to be feared, uh, as well as um, don't take anything from anybody that you can't, you know, give back immediately. This helped me really talk out my relationship with that, with the idea of money, with the idea of wanting more and doing more and, and being more uh, for myself. Through the program, I started to work more with my financials and my back office, so to speak. And as of now, I have three contracts lined up for um, conferences after the program ends. And I feel as though having to constantly articulate my vision, um, where I want to go and who I am now, 
I, I feel like I couldn't have done that without this. Simple answer, yes. <laughs> um, more complex part of the answer is I think that every business needs kind of like those foundational principles to be able to know like where you're going and then how to infuse like milestones and checkpoints so that you can make sure you're meeting them. Um, as someone who has been in other business programs, I think a lot of what was always missing is someone to do an audit on your business, someone to look at your business plan, someone to look at what are the components of your business that's missing, and then for you to figure out how do you want to fill in the gaps. And that's been really significant for me as I prepare to grow into the company that I can you know, support other people with in, um, having a job and being able to service more individuals. So I would definitely say those are the things that come to mind.